G'day mates, how's it going? I'm Cattlebear and welcome back to A Skeptic's Guide to Magic. I'm just going to get back in and uh, continue on my journey to make sacred flames. Um, let me see if I can find... If I can find matches. If not, we're going to have to work something out. I don't know what. Um, is this, this, this isn't my car. This still isn't my car. I claim it's because I'm colorblind, but I just forgot which one was my car. <laughs> I'm playing these within a reasonable amount of time of each other, but still not um, not as reasonable as one might hope. <laughs> so I forget little things. I just forget little things. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. We're going to get this done. Okay. Ah, oh, Mr. Chapman, welcome home. Leave it out, Cecil. I want to have words with you. Oh, what is it regarding? It's regarding that young lady who showed up earlier. Didn't you notice anything strange when, going on when I left with her? Hmm, I don't seem to recall you leaving with a young lady, but you do seem to be talking rather strangely now. Psst. Like you can't read or something, buddy. But bravo, sir, bravo. <sighs> I get it. Okay, so, uh, no, I don't want to sit down. Coffee? Coffee? Okay, uh... Ooh. No, 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 I just want him. I just want him. Don't I don't know where things Okay, so I can't find matches. Um putting I don't know why I still carry this around here me either. Um shopping list? I need a magic wand. Also there's a heart on my shopping list, that's good. Thanks, uh Val. Okay, uh Business directory. Let's see. S for Smith Mode. Oh, okay. Here it is. Over on the Coventry Road, right on the way to the lodge. Smith Motors will get your motor running. 2020 Coventry Road, Birmingham. B26 4XY 0121 747-2436. Location available, Smith Motors. Nice. Okay, but can I use the steering rod as my wand? No. Okay. okay, so maybe maybe this will help me progress the story. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see. We will see indeed. Okay, to my car. Okay, Smith Motors, Smith Motors, Smith Motors. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. I haven't got any track of everything. everything. I speak English goods. You should take up biking again? You used to be a biker? Hmm, interesting. Interesting. Yeah, yeah. That's, oh, apparently I can't walk behind those. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Listen, if I'm not under arrest, I'm not coming anywhere with you. And even if you do arrest me, I probably won't be answering any of your questions. This is in connection with a very serious criminal matter, Mr. Smith. You understand that your refusal to cooperate may cause me to regard you as a suspect. You can regard me all you like, sweetheart. You aren't even slightly concerned that something may have happened to one of your customers? No, not really. If you've met my customers, you'd understand. Most of them are wankers. Thing is, I get a lot of people coming through here and I've never been good at remembering faces. I don't remember any bikes though. If there's been a crime against a bike, I'd be the man you'd should come to. I see. Well, thanks for all the help. Don't mention it. Lester, fancy seeing you here. I didn't know you were a biker. Used to be. Think you've taken it up again. You should think long and hard about that. These things are death traps. But who am I to come between a man and his midlife crisis? 
Your being here doesn't have anything to do with this murder investigation, does it? Because you are supposed to be on leave. Like I said, I'm here to see a man about a bike. Mm -hmm. Well, some of us do have work to do. I'm heading back over to Central. I'll see you around, Lester. So hopefully not too soon. Fine. Jeez, lady, that. It's a nice bike. Not my job getting this place up. I know. I've already... You know, you know, I just want... I want to be in on some of these things. There's an oily rag in here. Take it. Which was I have stolen an oily rag. Is that oily rag here before, or did... I just don't care about it. Not really my kind of music. Oh yeah? Who are you into? Steel Pulse, Bashara, Musical Youth. Reggae, huh? Isn't that stuff all kind of repetitive? And this isn't? Yeah, fair point. Show things. Barrels of oil. Hello. I wonder what the red button does. Me too. Me too. He seems to be working hard. Or well, hardly working. My name's Blake. What can I do for you? Does your bike need service? Not likely. I haven't had a bike since the 70s. Let me guess. The wife meant to get rid of it? Ex-wife. Perfect time to get back in the saddle then. I'll have to think about it. Well, I also sell a selection of tools here if you fancy yourself a handyman. What can I do for you? Show me what you have for sale. You have a blowtorch for sale. Well, I'm buying your blowtorch. Silicon grease, glue, wire, spark plug, steel square, hello bulb, saw, wrench. I wonder if I need all of these things eventually. Hmm, this feels empty. Yeah, gotta supply your own fuel, I'm afraid. Hmm, I'm sure I can find a propane tank somewhere. I saw one. I saw one, didn't I? Hmm, you handled that detective very well. Nice job. Thanks, in this line of work you'll learn to keep your mouth shut pretty quickly. Haven't heard anything about a turf war. I'm not about to get involved either way. You think our investigation has something to do with rival biking gangs? I don't think anything, alright? I'm just staying out of it. If you take my advice, you'll do the same. Run this place by yourself? That's right, used to have a partner, but it didn't work out. People have this annoying habit of dying. What's the biker scene like these days? I've been out of touch for a while, what's the biker scene like these days? Same as it's been for years. You've got the normal folk, the hobbyists, then you've got the one percenters. You mean the bike gangs? Yeah, exactly. This here is outcast territory right now. They're all nasty pieces of work. Good customers, though. Let me see. There's also motorcycle gangs that we need to worry about. More of a musical youth man myself. Room's not for customers. Well, I haven't actually bought anything, so technically I'm not a customer. Um. It was either. Oh, I think it was by um Fee's house. I think, I think it's by Fierce Flat. It was like a barbecue or something, uh, with a propane tank. Right? Yeah, there, there, that. Propane tank must be for the barbecue. Use item. Because I tried to pick this up earlier because I'm an idiot. Hmm, yes, yeah, so we should be able to refill the small propane cylinder from here. Easy does it. This doesn't seem safe. There, refueled. Okay, now maybe I can do my plan. Maybe I can do my plan. Just maybe. Go to the police station. My plan is to start a fire in the police station bathroom. I don't think I have a good plan. I don't think I have a solid plan at all, but you know, you know, it's a plan. It's very planny. Very, very planny. Hello friends, I am here. It is I, Lester. I have come to do things that fuck. I have come to do things that are not suspicious. I assume I need to use this. Um Wait, just the boy torch? There's nothing in there to do with night. Um Oily rag. Yes, I'll throw this rag away. Sorry, I wasn't sure for a second. My plan was to my plan was to burn the business director, to be honest. I think I might be losing my mind. At least the fire will be contained. Oh no, there is a fire! Oh no guys! You better not have been smoking in there, Lester. 
bloody alarms. Nope, I was not smoking. But she definitely knows that I was in there. Come on, Quinn, move your backside. There better not be another ruddy drill, I swear. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm not suspicious. See you later, guys. Yeah, I need to take a photo. Ooh, hello. You know Quinn is just playing something called Day of the Tentacle. Ah, oh, Day of the Tentacle. That's great. That's great. Oh, that's it. There are a few bookmarks. I'll just take photographs of the relevant papers. That should do it. Now I need to get this developed. Yeah, I can do that. Is it what I'm looking for? Amazing kind of weapons the police confiscate sometimes. Okay. This place could use some organization. Well, I'm sure it's organized in a way. Boxes of evidence. Okay. We're gonna go. I would have liked some weapons, but I obviously am not allowed those weapons. This is today's lawful. Okay. We're just gonna go. We're gonna go. Oh, hey guys, what's up? Uh, see you later. I guess I'll talk to these people. I'm glad for a bit of fresh air, really. Bloody ridiculous. I'll just leave Plus Moto inside next time. I hate sunshine. <laughs> yeah, me too. Oh, hello. I'll bet this is just a drill. At least it's not my fault this time. Okay. See you later, guys. I'm going. I need to go to that prison for later. Custody block. Not really a prison, but the custody block. Okay, so I need to go to the forensic lab to get my photos developed. A bit was my little sticking point, like working out how to start my fire. It wasn't a huge issue, but you know. I seriously thought I'd use a business directory. Now that oily rag did come in handy. Okay. Use. Take a while. Could take a while. I've seen photo developing scenes in movies before. Just I have developed the photos. Right, better get these images over to Val at the Magic Circle. Maybe she can make some sense of all this mystical malarkey. Look, I just, I just want to see, um, inventory, photographs, items, photographs. I should deliver these to Val, okay. Val, I am on my way, I'm on my way, I'm on my way. Val, Val, where are you Val? I know, she's at the Magic Circle, it's okay. I know, I know where she is, she's at the Magic Circle. It's fine. Circle, magic circle, it was below me. It was straight below me. Okay. Hello, Val. I short for Valerie or Valentina. Probably Valerie. Cool. Yeah, I wasn't going to steal the book, so I did the next best thing. Here's the pages your friend have bookmarked. Oh, now this is really interesting. Will it be useful? It better be. I'm sure it will. It's gonna take me some time to translate all of this. She gets some rest, Lester. Look, Nack. It's been a long day. Get some sleep and check in with me tomorrow morning. By the way, I really do appreciate everything you're doing to help us. Aw, oh, you're welcome, Val. I knew we could count on you. Mm -hmm. so I guess it's time for me to progress time. Hello, I am home. My, my home is a hotel, but you know, whatever. Oh, hello. What brings you here, Kim? Hey, Dad. How did you get in here? The owner let me in. Seems like a nice bloke. 
I'm gonna kill him one of these days. For letting me in? I don't want to cause a fuss. No, it's just... He didn't mention you were here. Maybe I should go. You don't seem happy to see me. I'm always happy to see you. No, you're not. Mm hmm. Is it because I remind you of him? Oh, did I? Did my son die? Lester? Lester, is everything okay? Kim. Can't keep doing yourself in over this, Dad. It wasn't your fault. Mum says. Whoever hasn't told you everything. I just wanted to let you know that I've been getting auditions. I don't know how close I am to learning a part, but at least they're willing to see me. You'll find a part. You've always been talented. You get that from her. Please take care of yourself, Dad. For me. Good luck at your next audition. Mm-hmm. Let's start. Thanks. She was worried, so she came to see her dad. Fuck. Let's start. It's okay. Oh. Oh, that's, uh, that's V. The morgue is at the back of the coroner's court. That's where they're keeping Jason. Gotta get inside. Thankfully, I brought along some spells and ingredients which can help with that. Oh, this is me. I see. I have to do this. Can I leave? Put down here. This isn't the building I need to get into. Okay. They want me to go around the back, but I'm going to try the front first. Coroner's court. They're not going to let me waltz in from the front door. I'll need to take him it was with Try Val. No, not Val. Sorry. Sorry. Val's nice. Sounds pretty bad. Okay. This garage door leads into the morgue. Open. Ah. Shut tight. Okay. Um. Spellcraft. Crafting. Portal? Powerful potion used to open portals. Means of gaining entry. Shadow wine. This magic potion can render the subject almost invisible. Shadow dwellers snare. Interesting. And item belonging to the one who passed. A spell to communicate with the spirit of the rest. Ah, okay. Okay, so I need a portal. Use item. Portal. So the appropriate apparatus for portal. Flight key. Hope this works. Spirit of hair, God send thee care. Digger of holes, come to my call. Make me a passage, seek through this wall. Wow. That's one of my biggest portals yet. Fair enough. Fair enough. We're making a priority this one, Howard. Don't muck it up. The home office pathologist will be here first thing in the morning. You gotta give him everything he needs, understand? You sure you don't want to join us yourself, Chief? We can make a date of it. That's wrong on so many levels, I don't know where to start. Do you expect anything less from me? <laughs> Fair point. I'll leave you two alone. Okay, so I'm gonna to need to be invisible, I assume. Find a card, want it to be this one. It's a mop and bucket here. Like, usually for a broomstick or whatever. Oh, okay. I'm gonna save the game. I'm gonna need some help staying hidden. Okay, so I need to do the spell. Um. Spellcraft, crafting, shadow wine. Finish. Um. Look, the appropriate apparatus. A shadow dweller's snare. Is it the cord? Right. Oh! Oh, okay. Okay. 
I need something to get the cobwebs down with. The broom. The broom. Okay. 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 The mop, even. Should work. Okay. <laughs> now. Now. Cobweb. I am she that moveth with the shadow behind the tides of death and birth. I am she that cometh forth by night, and no man seeth my face. Okay, that's kind of shadow walking. Brr. Ever feel a warm breath on the back of your neck? Equipment of a mortician. How to make friends and influence people? You should start by not working in a mortuary. Wow, that's kind of mean. Equipment of a mortician. I'm here to see Jason. I'm not here to sit around and relax. I just want to look at everything. Yeah, I shouldn't open these. I think I guess it's polite to wash your hands after working with the dead. It's hard to wash your hands when you're just a shadow. Bloody tools. Do I have something of Jason's? Squidgy. She could have at least given you a blanket. No offense, Jason, but this is more of you than I ever wanted to see. That will require a spell. Okay. Recipe. Contact. I don't think so. Okay. So I need to, um, I need to do some shadow crafting. Is there a spell crafting given? Okay. Finish. It's item. Contact. Okay, an item belonging to the one who passed. Is that his ritual knife? I didn't write. Um, album? Jason, Jason, Jason. Please talk to me, Jason. I don't remember where I got that album from. I guess if I examined it, I wouldn't know. Rise and shine, Sleepy Joe. There are places to go. Jason? Do you know the one thing I enjoy about these sad, vulgar lumps of flesh? It's the smell of things. The other four senses can bugger off with smell. It really makes you feel alive. You're not him. Of course not, Jason's dead. Do you like talking to corpses, my love? What are you then, some kind of demon? <laughs> <laughs> Tell me who you are, I'll get the hell out of this body. This isn't a game. We've met before. No, we haven't. I'd remember, if you insist. I'll make a promise to you. Before we have finished talking, I will tell you my name. But first, may I tell you something else? I ask you to pretend like I have a choice. It's been 250 years since I last came to this island. Back then, they still used to burn people at the stake. Women, I should say. They didn't often burn the men, did they? And your kind of move, they love the fucking Witch. If the accused was lucky, they would suffocate rather quickly. If they were unlucky, oh, it could take hours. Such screaming, such agony. Am I supposed to learn something from this? Perhaps you might, perhaps not. Consider it a bedtime story to see you through the long and dark hours ahead. Getting so very tired, I am. Night, Fianna. Wait, you said you'd tell me your name. Oh. Damn. What the fuck did you get mixed up in, Jason? Was that... Was that her? Because the only name she mentioned, the, the only name that the demon mentioned was Fianna. Or is that just... Is that just fate? Hmm. Let's go. Need to get dressed. Oh, hello. Hello, Fee. There have been some new developments. Am I to understand that my room is now a public thoroughfare? This is important, Lester. I do value my privacy, you know. Then you should have worn a bigger towel. <laughs> do you know Smith Motors on Coventry Road? 
As a matter of fact, I do. However, as soon as you're dressed and ready. Me and Val will be waiting in the back room. Okay, I guess we're getting to visit. Let's see. Clothes. Clothes are in the wardrobe. Clothes are in the wardrobe. There we go. Oh, he's leaving. He's just leaving. Oh, he's in a nice suit. Good work, Lester. Good work. Okay. So. I guess I should talk to him. Cecil, I've been meaning to talk to you about the mole growing on my bath. Really? That is a particular topic of conversation. I want you to get rid of it. You don't feel that it adds a little extra colour to an otherwise drab bathroom? No, I don't feel that it does. Very well, I will have it taken care of at some point. <laughs> I love Cecil. Cecil's great. Bye, Cecil. Okay. So, we got enough time to at least see what's going on here. Let's see, let's see. She's Smith Motors. She just go to face flat and be like, hey, what's up? I know there are achievements that I'm probably not gonna get because I just wanna I just wanna play the game. I don't I don't care about getting all the achievements. Somebody had a rough night. Talk. Hey, got any booze? You smell like you've had enough. Nah, not yet. I'm still conscious. Still conscious. I should drink. What are you doing here? How did you wind up here? Yeah, I ask myself that a lot. But in the cosmic sense, I mean, how did you get here on the pavement? Oh, don't remember. Let's drink. Are you a biker? Yeah, I'll crush the MC till I die. Which could be pretty soon at this rate. I'm sure you'd be patched if it didn't mean going up. You're patched? You're, you're patched? Yeah, every member of a biker gang wears a patch on their back. Symbol of loyalty. You got to earn it, though, first though. Honor and brotherhood, that's what you talking about. That's strength. Do you need some help? Do you need help getting up? I need booze is what I need. Got any? That's strength. I don't have any booze. Well, I'll leave you to it. I get the feeling I have to give this guy booze. Like, um, what's in my inventory? I don't have any booze. Maybe that's a, an extra thing I could do. You know, give him some booze, get some information. Maybe I need to give him some booze to get some information. Hello, my good friend. How long have you known for uh, Fire and Val? How long have you known Fire Mal? Since I was kids. Fire's dad used to work here. I'm calling it Fire at the moment. I'll call it Fear later. I let them use my back room for their little meetings. Don't see the harm in it. Kiss them off the streets at least. Got anything I can buy? Any alcohol? Oh, okay. That's fine. Fire told me you're expected. Don't mess about with these girls. They're protected. Is that a threat? I didn't say I'm the one protecting them. Once you start getting into celestial demonology, things take a dark turn. Listen to this. It's Lequeu. She travels between dimensions, enslaving entire races, infusing their living bodies into a diabolical machine of flesh. The weak die and their meat is consumed by the strong. Aside from death, insanity is the only escape from her evil machinations. Shit. She reminds me of Thatcher. <laughs> you said there would be new developments. Lester! Did you sleep well? Not really. Aw, oh, you should try chewing some valerian root. I think I just need a little less stress in my life. Don't we all? So did you learn anything yet from those photographs I gave you? Well, this vulgar Latin is really hard to crack. I haven't come across any references to a mother of dreams yet. But on the plus side, I spoke to a demon last night. On the plus side. Where did she meet this demon? She was shopping down at Great Western? At the city morgue, actually. What? You broke into the morgue? Are you insane? Not as far as my counselor could tell. But she wasn't all that good at her job. 
Pearl's training is a spirit summoning spell to talk to Jason. It's easier with the recently departed. But something else answered the call, another being. Right, of course it did. So now we know why Jason was using a Life of Magic A Primordialis. He was trying to summon an entity. Something ancient, dark, and powerful. Can we approach this like rational people for a moment? Tell me something practical. Why would Jason want to summon a demon that powerful? It's actually a good question. Do you have any enemies or anyone he might have been frightened of? Hmm. Devil Dog? Look, I thought we were cutting all this talk of demons. Devil Dog isn't a demon, he's a bloke. Trevor Devil Dog Thompson, the local chapter leader of Outcast MC. He also happens to be Jason's stepdad. You're thinking domestic violence? Jason never said anything about it. Let's just say Devil Dog has a reputation. But a name like that, I bet he does. Where can I find him? He's not an easy man to get to see. But I guess you'd find him in the Outcast Clubhouse. He's at the Green Man up in Bromford. I'll start there then. If you can deal with the spooky stuff. Sounds like a fair trade. Good luck, Lester. I can go to the Green Man now. And that's where I can get alcohol. Maybe I need alcohol to talk to that guy. Because that guy's an Outcast MC. And maybe he has information on Devil Dog. Ha! Huh. That's my theory right now. But, but, I'm going to call it here. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you have a great day, night, whatever. And I will catch you in another video. Bye for now. Bye.